This waste vegetable oil, once used to cook up French fries in Sadler Dining Hall, is heading for a former greenhouse on the campus of the SUNY College of Environmental Science and Forestry. ESF senior Greg Boyd and his helpers will turn the waste cooking oil from Syracuse University into environmentally friendly biodiesel fuel. The fryer oil in this 55-gallon drum is strained and pumped into the bioprocessor. We add the methanol and the sodium hydroxide into their own quartz. We add sulfuric acid, which is used to neutralize the free fatty acids, which are produced from frying the oil. So we add all the components to the machine. And after 24 hours, we have the biodiesel and the glycerol. And ESF scientists have a use for the glycerol in addition to the traditional uses. We're actually making biodegradable plastic from the glycerol. It's fully uh, recyclable. You can make soap from the glycerol. It goes into a lot of makeup products. 17% of the ESF fleet of vehicles runs on a biodiesel mixture, usually B20. So this is a demonstration to show that biodiesel is safe and it works well as a fuel. Greg's pretty sure it works well. He's been running it in his own car for the past two and a half years.